Welcome back. We are here looking at the U.S. indices, and this is going to be my daily forecast for the U.S. indices for Thursday, uh, November 5th, 2020. If you like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. Uh, we also have a signal service on Patreon. You're welcome to join that. You'll get access to our full technical analysis and a forum full of traders at this point. Um, yes, we'll start out by looking at the uh, S&P 500. And as you can see, S&P 500 has done really well today. We're up 2.7% uh, for the day. So we rallied significantly when the last uh, when the result came in that basically Donald Trump was about to win. Then we had a major pullback. Um, um, and then we found out that the, you know, Biden was going to win. And then we rallied again. At the point, at this point, we are trading above the 50 moving average. We'll probably find resistance here at around uh, 3,553. And then to the, for example, the very high. So, um, Yes, the very lows here are down here. So we are trading away um, above this range here. So uh, possible entry here. To enter here at the moment is, is fairly risky. Um, if we break uh, these, uh, these, uh, these highs here, then of course this will go significantly higher. But we can also round into major resistance here and fall back. Um, technical indicators for S&P 100 are very bullish at this point. Um, but best entry is basically down here, or best entry is just above the 50 moving average. Uh, we are at the moment fairly stretched, and usually a pullback towards the 50 moving average is the right uh, place to enter this market, or a pullback towards the 100 moving average is even better for to enter this market. Uh, but this has been a fantastic bullish run. And uh, this is mainly due to because the expectation of a more stimulus, which is the, which the market is is uh, begging for. So look at the Dow Jones, very similar thing here. We rally quite significantly. We're trading a low at 26, trading a high of uh, 90, uh, 29. And we have broken the 50 moving average, pulled back a little bit, but we're still above the 50 moving average. Technical indicators are very bullish for Dow Jones. All of them, we're not even close to being overbought, so we may go significantly higher. Uh, a pullback towards the 100 moving average is a possible entry. Pullback towards the 300 is even better, and pullback towards the 150 is basically your best shot of entering this market. But that's not going to happen at this point. We are going higher before we even go lower. It's just a matter of whether or not we break these highs here. And I was chosen basically to stay out of the market at this point i don't like when there's a lot of a lot of noise in the market for example news for example what is happening now in the elections because the uncertainty is so high we could just as good to have broken uh, minus three percent to the downside uh, instead of to the upside so so therefore i tend to wait so we look at that nasdaq We can see that we rallied way above the 50 moving average. We are heading towards 12,200 at this point. The technical indicators are all turning around. Um, if you wanted to enter this market, this is probably a good entry. It is. A uh, better entry is basically pull back towards the 100 moving average or a fairly full pull back towards the 100 moving average or the, uh, no, the 50 moving average, sorry, or the 100 moving average. That is an absolute bottom of this. As you can see, that is major support there. Um, major re resistance will be, be here at 12,200 and 12,400 or 500. Uh, if we break this, then we are going significantly higher. That's, uh, but this is fairly pure speculation. This can drag out for days, even weeks, and even months. Uh, and uh, there will be no guarantee of any stimulus, just Bear in mind, there is not going to be any stimulus before, most likely in January or in February. And when markets uh, re realize that that is going to be the case, then then uh, it will be absolutely havoc. Will drop like a rock, and that's um, that is something that you probably take uh, advantage of if we drop all the way back towards the hundred moving average. So, hope you find this video helpful. You're welcome to support our channel by subscribing, hit the like button, and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. Good luck and thank you very much.